Hornet Hornets, please stand for the Pledge of Allegiance. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. And now for the Texas Pledge. Honor the Texas flag. I pledge allegiance to thee, Texas, one state, under God, one and indivisible. You may be seated. Now for one minute of silence in which you may reflect, pray, meditate, or engage in any other silent activity that is not likely to interfere with or distract another student. I can't wait for the favorites dance. Um, that's not happening anymore. <gasps> what? Instead of a favorites dance, Student Council is hosting a spring festival on Thursday, March 7th from 2 to 6 p.m. There will be a variety of concessions and carnival style games that you guys can go attend. And those with perfect attendance are able to leave school early in order to attend. <laughs> Let's kick off spring break with something fun, exciting, and new. Hope to see you there. Congratulations to lifelong Hornet senior Cooper Floyd on being named the Flyer Bluff High School Career and Tech Student of the Month. Cooper is a member of the BPA, UIL Computer Applications Team, the Robotics Team, and the Science Olympiad. Cooper has a passion for computers and video games. He plans on attending Newmont College of Computer Science in Salt Lake City, where he plans on studying cybersecurity and networking. Hi, I'm Camille, and I'm here with one of the Anchored for Life advisors. Hi, I'm Miss Stewart. We're here to talk to you about the canned food drive. Um, some of our Anchored for Life students have put together a service project, and we are wanting all the high school kids to help get involved. Um, they're going to be collecting um, non-perishable food items, um, such as cans of soup, ramen noodles, anything that our food pantry can utilize and help to pass out at the school. Thank you. Thank you. You can drop off your canned foods in the counselor's office. Cafeteria. At the front office. Or in room 612. Please donate to your community. Good morning, Hornets. My name is Layla. And I'm Addie. Thanks, Thanks for tuning in to this edition of the Hornets Nest News. <laughs> today is Friday, February 23rd. And for lunch today, the Hornet Cafe is serving corn dog, pizza, burger, sun butter sandwich with cheese stick, french fries, side salad, and pears. <laughs> Delicious. <laughs> Speaking of corn dogs, what did the corn dog say when it won an award? Hmm, no clue, but I'm sure whatever it was, it was corny. <laughs> oh my goodness. <laughs> oh, shit. The dog said, I finally mustered up the courage to win. <laughs> <laughs> oh, nice pun. <laughs> oh my gosh. <laughs> Class Bride and Art will be on display this weekend, and the Hornets are off to the challenge. Today, 
Varsity Girls and Boys Soccer is home to Carroll. Varsity Tennis begins the Bluff Tough Tournament. Tomorrow, track and field is at Ingleside Relays, and JV Boys and Girls Soccer are home to Carroll. Good luck to the swim and dive team as they compete at the state meet today at the University of Texas. <laughs> Congrats to the district champions girls basketball team as they have advanced to the regional tournament where they will play Leander Glenn at 7.30 p.m. in San Antonio tonight. That's a far drive. For real. <laughs> Remember that we're on pep rally schedule today. Make sure to buy your dodgeball ticket at lunch. Tickets will not be sold at the door. All students that purchase a ticket to the tournament will go to the gym to watch at 3.20 p.m. And any students that do not purchase tickets will remain in their eighth period classes. I'm definitely going. It's going to be fun. Me too. <laughs> Calling all volunteers! The Special Olympics is looking for volunteers and it will take place at Hornet Stadium on April 6th. Oh, don't forget to order your yearbook ASAP. Order yours now at www.yearbookforever.com or talk to Mrs. Brandewee in room 504. Calling all Hornets. Do you have school spirit? Do you love to cheer? Now is your opportunity to show off your Hornet pride and try out for the FBHS cheerleading team. Pick up an application packet at the high school receptionist desk or in room 408. There will be a mandatory parent meeting on Tuesday, March 5th in the FBHS teaching theater. There are required forms that will be needed. Tryouts will be held March 22nd with the clinic happening March 18th through the 21st. CPH, go Hornets. Parking tags are needed to park on school property. Students can park in the library, band hall, and varsity gym lots only. Seniors, please come to the art display cases in the 200 hall to check your senior portrait. If there are any errors in your name or your photo is missing, please see Ms. Brandwee in room 504. If you don't tell us about any errors, they will be printed as they are. Finally, it's Fun Fact Friday. Did you know that your nose is always visible to you? You can't see it very well because your brain ignores it through a process called unconscious selective attention. So even though your nose is right in front of you, your brain focuses on other things instead. Very interesting fact. <laughs> That's all of our news today. Have a fantastic Friday.